Welcome everybody to DeMatha basketball. The popcorn's popping. It's the biggest game in round town. The DeMatha Stags versus the Gonzaga Eagles. My name is Rob Blandini. I'm joined by the legendary Neil Murphy for this broadcast tonight. Does legendary just mean old, Robbie? <laughs> <laughs> but it's not often you find these two teams kind of struggling to find their identity at this point, right? Uh, Gonzaga having a great year at 18 and three, but they've lost their last two. They're upset by good counsel up and only last week and then they lost to a really tough PVI team. The math had kind of been up and down all year. Uh, tough loss the other night here to McNamara, a tightly contested game, came down to a final play, the ball just didn't bounce our way. Yep. So yep. we're looking for the Stags to get, get back on track tonight. Big game as always, the math and Gonzaga. All right.
right, as we get the tip off here for the, the uh, Eagles of Gonzaga, they're going to start number one, Ryan Sable. Number three, Derek Dixon. Number five, Nicholas Lewis. 15, Thomas Batiste. 24, Alex Drew. For the Stags, they're going to start number one, Malcolm Thomas. Number two, Jaden Winston. Number five, Isaiah Arnold. Number four, Mason So. And number 11, Adam Fox. And we're off. Stags win the tip. Gonzaga comes out man to man. So with it at the top. Off to Fox. Fox with the cutting. Arnold. Arnold over to Winston for the three. No good. Rebound. Re re rebound to So. So runs at the offense. Nice drive by Isaiah Arnold. Great kick out. We just so with the to pull knock. up. Off rebound. Big rebound by Fox. Ripped away by Gonzaga. 24. Alex with the putback. Winston here with the ball, bring up for the Stags. Off the Fox at the elbow here. He'll turn and face, start to drive. A lot of contact on that one. Might have missed one there. Good move by Adam Fox, quality shot, just not able to knock it down. Off to Nick Lewis with the floater in the middle, no good. Rebound to So. So out, out to Malcolm Thomas. Here we go. Malcolm Thomas with the jam for the Stags. Great look ahead for the easy bucket. Gonzaga with it. Ryan Sable for three, no good. Rebound to So. So's going to push it. So on the drive. Kick in the Fox. Fox with it. Shot. Foul. Fouls to go to Thomas Batiste. Fox will be the line shooting two. Nice move by Adam Fox, drawing the contact. Certainly, if Coach Jones could draw up a game plan here, he'd like to see number 15, Thomas Matisse, saddled with a little bit of foul trouble early. Mm -hmm. First one good for Fox. He'll shoot one more. Fox will make the second. Stags will go up four to two here. Six twenty-eight left in the first quarter. Stags here with the two-two-one press here, trying to slow the slow the Eagles down. Fifteen with the drive over to Ryan Sable again for three. That's going to go. That's going to be good. Winston with it now. Kick out the Fox. Fox to Thomas at the elbow. He'll turn and face. Spin move, shot, rebound. Thomas, and it goes in. There we go. Missed the first one, stayed with it, knocked it back in. Uh, we're having some camera issues. We're working on that right now. We're working with the skeleton crew. Nick Lewis over to Alex. Alex back to Ryan. Ryan Sable at the top, running the offense for the Eagles. No drive over to Derek Dixon. He'll shoot a three. No good. Rebound. Have a. Foul, I believe on Winston here. Tough call there, Jaden Winston, nice job using his body to secure the rebound. Referee saw it a little differently. It'll be Gonzaga ball on the baseline. Dixon with the inbound here. Going to the Batty's, Batty's gonna lose it. Arnold with it, he's on the run. He'll miss a layup, rebounded by Fox. Put back that Fox. Good effort by Fox following the play. Arnold missed the chippy, Stags still cash in. Lewis down the middle, he'll be fouled. Foul's gonna be on Adam Fox there. Nick uh, Lewis here for the, will shoot two. Good move by Lewis, got in the paint. Fox came over to help, wasn't quite there. Little hip check as he went by. First of two is good. Roger Garfield coaching the Eagles tonight in place of Coach Steve Turner. And the second is good. Stags lead 8-7 here with about five minutes left in the second quarter. Winston here on the offense for the Stags. 
over to Thomas. Thomas will turn the look. Hit Arnold at the top, over to, to the wing to Winston. Winston bobbles. So at the top. He'll make a move, spin, jump, and no good. Nick Lewis with the ball for the Eagles. Guarded by So. Nice job by So, stopping penetration. We'll hand off to Sable, Sable with it at the top. Guarded by Arnold. Drive by Dixon, pull up, no good. Rebound to Winston, Winston's gonna push. Over to Arnold, corner three, no good. Rebound Fox, we're gonna have a foul on the floor here. On Fox, I believe, that's gonna be uh, his second. AJ, JJ Massacoy entering the game for the Stags, the sophomore. Good effort by Adam Fox, but certainly he had a good start to the game. You hate to see him saddled with fouls, reducing those minutes. Absolutely. See if JJ can pick up the slack a little bit. 2-2-1 two, two, here for the Stags. Uh, Lewis here gets the offense for the Eagles, guarded by So. He's got Sable in the corner for three. No good. It's a great box out effort by the Stags. That just, oh, it was the math ball. I'm sorry, excuse me. Like JJ, the great job boxing out, but he's got the last part of the drill. Go get the ball. Did go off the mat. My apologies. Okay. AJ McCleary, AJ McCleary in, the in the game for the Stags. Dixon with a little up and under. No good. Rebound to JJ. JJ's going to give it to Jaden. Jaden's going to run the offense here for the Stags. Picked by Arnold. Out of the middle, Winston, little floater, no good. Rebound over to Dixon. Dixon with it. He'll pull for three. No good. Rebound to Winston. Winston here is going to slow, slow things up here for the Stags. That's four here, that's four at the top. Over to McCleary. McCleary with it on the, on the wing. Going to hit Winston at the top. Winston on the drive. Good pass to J.J. Massacre. It's going to be blocked. Good penetration by Jaden Winston. A little drop off to J.J. Uh, wasn't able to finish. You got to figure at this point next year, that's either going to be a bucket or he'll be going to the foul line. Absolutely. J uh, Ashton Meeks, number three, the freshman in for the Stags. Number 11, Jack Caden in for the Eagles. And down to Massacoy. Massacoy in the clear on the wing with a cutting Thomas. Thomas going to, we got a foul here or a shot clock violation. Shot clock violation for the Stags. Eagles ball. Derek Dixon here to run the offense for the Eagles. Over to Nick Lewis. Nick Lewis across the timeline. Hit Batty's, Batty's in the corner. Gonna be bobbled by the Eagles here. Should be the math of ball. AJ McClure to inbound for the Stags. In the Winston. A little delay plus here by Gonzaga. See if the Stags can cash in. McClure on the drive. I think about it. Hits Winston. Winston's gonna drive down the middle and lay it in. Nice little finish, was able to turn the corner, actually shot it with the right hand on the left side, off the backboard, stags up 10-7. Jerry Dixon here, over to Thomas, Batty's in the corner, he's headed to Harvard next year. Batty's gonna drive, hit back, hit back to Jack, Jack Caden with the ball. Back over to Nick Lewis. Nick 10 Lewis. on the shot clock. Lewis on the drive, good. Nice little move, gets in the lane, uses his body well, avoids the contact. Little tweener Winston, shot. Winston, pull up three, got it! I saw Jaden working on that shot in practice yesterday. The old bank three from straight away. It's a lost art. Lewis here on the offense for the Eagles. Over to Batty. Batty's in the corner. Go back over to Lewis. Pull up. No good. A big rebound for Maddox. The number 11, Jack Cady on the drive. Go out of bounds. 
Vagabal. Prashan Hill comes in the game, replacing J.J. Mersakoy. Gonzaga ball on the baselines. 13 now with 147 left here in the first quarter. Kick ball here. Ryan Sable to inbound for the Eagles. Sixteen on the shot clock. There we go. We heard Baddies goes up. No good. Still with it. Sable on the drive. Pull up. No good. Batted around. AJ Vitae with the Ooh. Ooh. We're gonna have a jump ball here. We're going to talk about it here. One referee signal technical foul. I believe was on a Gonzaga player. I'm not quite positive. He's talking to the other ref. <laughs> I believe the tech was on 23, I believe. Yeah, we're a long way away. There was a situation, loose ball, jump ball situation. Gonzaga player was standing up. The Matha player was on the ground. It looked like the Gonzaga player picked him up, and then he went to the ground pretty hard. So it was just the force of the play or, you know, say we're at the other end of the court. Referee explained the play to um, acting coach Roger Garfield. He seems okay with it. Ashton Meeks will go to the line for the technical. First one's good. And second of two is going to be good. Two big free throws here for the freshman Ashton Meeks. Stags lead 15 9 here with a minute 34 left in the first quarter. It'll be Stags ball out at half court. Meeks to inbound for the Stags. In the Winston. Winston with it. And bring look, it over the timeline. Look for the Stags to run something, maybe for Ashton Meeks to get a three. Meeks from deep from three. In and out. Nick Lewis is going to push for the Eagles. Good look. Maybe a little deep. He'll drive down the middle. And that's going to be no good. Batted around. Rebounded by the Eagles. And we're going to have a foul on the floor here, I believe, on Prashant Hill. Should be a shooting foul here. All right, Gonzaga ball on the baseline. Sable here to inbound. In the baddies, baddies are gonna get called for traveling here. Petit's caught the ball in bounds. Ashamik was guarding him. Ashamik ran away. I think it just surprised Petit where he ended up traveling. He was so surprised he was 15 feet from the bucket, unguarded. Uh, Alex Chumo for the Eagles to return as well as number 10, William Harper, into the game for the first time here for the Eagles. Kate Sebastian enters for the Stags here, inbounds to uh, Winston. Winston over the timeline, hit Thomas. Back to Winston here in the corner. Looking for Kate Sebastian at the top. He's going to pull for three. No good. Bad around. Ashton Meeks. Ashton Meeks back out to Kate Sebastian. He's going to think about it. Good effort by Prashant Hill. Keep that ball alive. Uh, by Winston. Kick out to Meeks. Meeks in the corner for three. No good. Dixon with it. Hit ahead to the Eagles. Number 23 here. Daniel Holmes with the lay in. Nice little finish on the break there. Malcolm Thomas coming over for the block, but it was too late. 15 11 here. 24 seconds left in the first quarter. Stags lead it. Just about identical with the shot clock. Little high ball screen here for Jaden Winston. We'll hit Meeks. Meeks the win back to Winston. Hits Thomas on the drive. He'll go up and be fouled. Foul's going to go on uh, William Harper here for the Eagles. 
Nice bring. little set there by the Stags to get Malcolm the ball in a good position there as he can slid down the lane. Gonna give Malcolm Thomas to the line, shooting two here. Five seconds left in the first quarter. First to two here. Is good. Number three, Derek Dixon will return for the Eagles. 5.9 to go, so Stags either way have to realize there's a lot of time left. Keep the ball in front. Thomas here for the second. And it's good. Gallon first squat is in the game for the Stags, number 34. So again, a lot of time. Want to play a little soft, just keep people in front. Can't get beat off the dribble. Nick Lewis over to Sable. Sable with it. Going to bobble. Still get it off. Mean no good. At the end of the first quarter, the Stags lead it 17-11. Well, if you're Coach Jones, you got to be happy. All right? You're playing a highly ranked team like Gonzaga, who's coming in with maybe a little bit more fire than usual because they've got two losses in a row. Other than maybe the two fouls on Adam Fox, pretty good first quarter. Stags have been able to run their half-court offense, get some good shots for some of their key guys. You know, the question, of course, can you sustain it over the four quarters? And that, those are the growing pains they're going through this year. Absolutely. But, yeah, again, good good quarter for the Stags. Great start uh, to get going, like you were saying, Murph. Um, you know, but going to keep going three more quarters. So, mm -hmm. uh, Couple of DeMath alums in the building tonight. Uh, Kenny Blakey, head coach at Howard University. He's got a lot of energy going on over there. And one of the guys working with it is his former teammate, Rod Balanis, who graduated in 88. Kenny was in 90. And also Doug John from the class of 89 is here. Doug's been in Texas and said he has not been back to the campus since he graduated wow. in 89. A lot has changed. Mm -hmm. In good ways. And it's, uh, it's great to see the success that Howard is having over there. Not only is Rod with him, you got Steve Settles is there. Elijah, uh, Hawkins. Elijah Hawkins is doing great. Um, uh, Aaron Rob Roberson over there as well, who's going to be, uh, I believe, well, he walked on the freshman this year uh -huh. uh, over there as well. They had a nice big win against uh, NC Central, I believe, last Saturday. Yeah, and then they won again last night against okay. South Carolina State. So, All right, so to start the second quarter here, we're going to have uh, Jacob Wallace, number 10. Uh, Kate Sebastian, number 23 here. Chris McCleavy, Rashawn Hill, and Galen Perksquat here starting for the Stags. For the Eagles, into Dixon. Dixon here to run, run the offense for the Eagles. A little 1 2 2 by the Stags. Looking to trap a little Tied bit. up. Got it right in the corner. What you want? Picked off by the Stags. Chris McCleavy with it. Out of bounds by the Eagles to beat the math the ball. So we got a different lineup out there. Certainly, we want the energy from the defense, but can we play with composure down at this end and again get the quality shots we were getting with that first group that was out there? So you hear that inbounder for the Stags in the Wallace. Jacob Wallace with it. He'll drive, kick out to Chris McCleavy for three. No good. Rebounded by the Eagles. Dixon with it. Over to Sable. Sable with it. Stags still in that zone. A lot of good pressure here by the Stags defense. And we're going to have a travel call on the Eagles. So Thomas Batty's with the travel call here for the Eagles. Two turnovers in a row here. Committed for the Stags. Sebastian inbound for the Stags. Five, Nick Lewis, Nick Lewis back in the game for the Eagles. Jacob Wallace with it across the timeline here. We'll hit Sebastian at the top. And we're going to have a foul call on Nick, I mean, I'm sorry, it's, uh, yes, Nick Lewis. Number five. The Stags ball on the side.
Chris McCleavy to inbound for the Stags. Over to Wallace. Wallace going to drag it across. We out play pull up at the elbow. Big shot for Jacob Wallace, the two-sport athlete, the football basketball athlete here at DeMatha. Tough move. That's one of those ones you'd like to bottle. Went hard to his left, pulled up, little elbow jumper. And the defense here by the Stags giving the Eagles some trouble here. And forth with the miss, rebound by Nick Lewis. It's going to be a blocking call. Good effort by the Stags there. A tough call, but the mistake starts. You got to close out the possession. You got the mystery. You know it's going to go long on the weak side. You got to box out and probably have to get that weak side guard dropping in there to help him. Nick Lewis to the line for the Eagles, shooting two. Wallace with it. Over to McCleavy, McCleavy with it, he'll think about it. Sebastian cuts, over to Prashawn Hill at the top. He'll swing over to Wallace, Wallace to McCleavy down low, got it. Nice, nice lay in. Good ball reversal, caught him down in the block, was able to lay it off the board. Sags extend a little got bit. Sable here in trouble. Over to Lewis, Lewis with it, over to Sable. He's going to drive up and under, no good. Can Sags grab it here? Out of bounds, Gonzaga ball. Coach Jones reminding all five white shirts to go rebound. <laughs> Sometimes we play at such a fast pace, guys start to leak out. Mm -hmm. have a little hold on the cutter there. Gonzaga ball on the baseline. Fix it inbound. That easy on the top. Over to Sable for three. No good. That's going to be short. Rebounded by Dixon. Dixon's going to be fouled on the baseline. Sable hit one early, and he's had a couple good looks at it. Just hasn't been able to ring the bell. Derek Dixon to the line for two. Oh, here comes the line change by the Stags. We'll have Isaiah Arnold, Jaden Winston, Mason So, Malcolm Thomas in for the Stags. Shooting one and one here. First one's good. Or just shooting one. A little confusion here by the referees. Should be one and one. I knew some was confused. I was just kind of hoping it wasn't me. <laughs> the only time I've seen that work before is when Teddy Smith was our oh, manager wow. over at McNamara. He had everybody in gym confused. I think we got four points out of it. <laughs> That's what a good manager does. Good, absolutely. Second one is good. Stags Dixon up. with the nice touch. Got the shooter's roll. Mason So here with the ball. Bring it up for the Stags. He'll be tra a good trap. Stolen by Dixon. I'm Lewis, sorry. Lewis over to Dixon. Dixon for three. Pull it. It's good. The tag got a little bit of a run. We're going to have a timeout here by Coach Jones. The tag came with some soft pressure last time. They went for the trap, caught the mouth a little off guard. Pass was there and out of bounds. Cash in with three down the other end. 5.39 to go. The math is still up for 21 18. A little run there by the Purple Eagles. Like a 32nd, I think. Yeah, they're out on the floor. Now, Ryan said, I mentioned the DeMatha guys before, Rob Bolanis, Kenny Burton, Doug John. They were in the 88, 89, 90. Okay. Well, Ryan Sable's dad, Mike Sable, would have played against these guys. I think he graduated from Gonzaga around 88 wow. and then played at Georgetown. Wow. Small world. Yep. Small world. All right, it's going to be the math of all coming out of the timeout here. 21-18, Stags lead it. 5.39 left here in the first half. So to inbound. A little pressure here by the Eagles. Winston. Winston was so. Zag a little 1-2-2, three-quarter court. 
So we'll get it across to Winston. Winston to run the offense here for the Stags. Stags a little unsure what we're running here. Hill, hand off to Hill, to Thomas, slam, is it home? Or, or possibly I was unsure what we were running. Rock up the sleep, coach, rock up the sleep. <laughs> well, they brought Malcolm Thomas way off from the bucket, set the screen, clear pass to the basket. Another steal by Isaiah Arnold. He'll lay it in for the Stags. Stags, good response from the timeout. Land the man here for the Stags. Lewis with the drive, no good, rebounded, bobbled. And we put back in the hill, hill to so. So over to Winston, Winston's gonna push, gonna drive, a little float shot, no good. Got a foul on Prashad Hill. Good effort by Prashant in terms of going the backboard, you love the effort, but you have to understand you're in the bonus, and every time they blow the whistle, we're gonna walk to the other end and shoot one on one. Yep. So you gotta pick your spots carefully, get even or get inside. Daniel Holmes here for the Eagles will shoot two. First one is good. Seconds gonna go in and out, rebounded by Thomas. Thomas over to So. So with it. Stags trying to get open here. Thomas at the elbow. He'll turn and face. Spin. Shot. No good. Bobbled. Winston with it. He'll get it back out to So for three. No good. Great effort by Jaden Winston to dig that ball out. It's what he does best. Pretty Dixon. good look like so. Just wasn't able to ring the bell. Dixon with the here for the Eagles at the top. Guarded by Arnold. Over to Batiste. He'll hand it off to 23. It's blocked. Ooh. Ooh. Going to be a charging foul here on number 23, Daniel Holmes. 3.52 left here in the second quarter. Stags lead 25-19. J.J. Massacoy taking one from the team there. Got pounded pretty good. It'll be Stag's ball. Alex Tumo is going to be entering back in for the Eagles. Winston here across the timeline. Maybe the time is at the elbow here. They'll turn and face again. Start to drive. It's going to be blocked. Over there, by, over there, Isaiah Arnold. Arnold on the drive. He's thinking about pulling up. We had Massacre, JJ with the drive. Up and under, and it falls. Good living. He must have done his math home. We got the lucky bounce. Dixon with it is going to be fouled here by Isaiah Arnold. Student section not a fan of that call. So they'll go to the line here for one and one. And for Derek Dixon. Eric Dixon, just a sophomore here. One and one, first one is no good. Rebounded by Massacoy. Over to So, So over the timeline. In and out, he's gonna drive. And a foul on the floor, I believe, here. Well, he'll go to the line for two. Good aggressive move by Mason So. The senior here headed to UNCG next year. First of two. Got it on the first. Second of two here. And it's good. So Stags lead here at 29 19, 3 11 left here in the first half. Stags man to man. 
Save it with him for the Eagles. He'll be guarded by So. So applying a lot of pressure here. Nice job by So keeping him out. And we're going to have a <laughs> player control foul here for Alex Chumere. Now, in the old days, Coach Wooten would give you McDonald's gift certificates if he took a charge. <laughs> JJ's up to his second meal right now. So with it here for the Stags, so bring it across the timeline here. Started by Sable for the Eagles. So will drive. Floater off the glass, it's gonna be good. Nice little runner off the glass with the left hand. Picks it with it here. Stags find a little pressure, bobbles it, lays it off the backboard. Rebound by Massacore. Once Over again, good, good half by JJ. So another drive, thinks about the air. Winston with it now. So pull it back out, set it up for the Stags. Over to So. So with it. 15 on the shot clock. Over to Thomas at the top. A little set play here. Thomas to Arnold. Oh, we're going to have a legal screen, I believe, on Winston. Uh, I'm sorry, J.J. Masterful J.J. It's a kind of a double sagger screen. Got to get set early. Nick Lewis here for the Eagles. Under two minutes, 31-19. The drive, and J.J. with his third one. Looks like it. J.J. Masterful coming up big on the defensive end again with another charge. Most conversations with the coach are about, coach, how can I get more minutes? Well, I can almost guarantee you take three charges in a half, you're going to get more minutes. But coach Jones will take that all day. Mason so with it here, guarded by Sable. And we're going to have a foul call. Stags will go to the line for one and one here. here for the Stags, so here. Stags have the alert, a little huddle down the other end, live ball. Gonna be off here. Dixon with it here, guarded by So. Good pressure here by So. Dixon on the drive, kick out. Ortiz over to Sable for three in the corner. Got it. <laughs> Timeout here, Eagles. 124 left here in the first half. Stags lead it 31 22. Nice job by the Eagles on that possession. Good ball movement. Thomas Patiz could have taken it. It was a decent shot. Gave it up for an even better shot. So again, the Stags applying pressure to the Eagles right now. It's been giving them a little bit of trouble here. The three, again, three charges for JJ Massacre in the first half is phenomenal for the Stag's defense. Not since the days of Vince Bartosi, I think, that we have three wow. fouls and a half. And it's still early. <laughs> Stags are in action again Friday night. St. Mary's Riken will be here on Friday. Hopefully we'll be back on the air. Corey Puffett on injured reserve tonight. I thank Robbie Landini for filling in there, as well as our, our crew, Deshaun Williams, Laurent. Chinique and Steve McDonald for stepping up and running it. Actually, Corey may be out of a job. <laughs> Winston inbound here, pressured by the Eagles in the so. So back over to Winston. Winston will push and pull it back out. 20 seconds on the so shot clock. Troy on the screen down low. He'll turn, hook, and get it in there. There's a massive for the nice bucket inside for the Stags. Making a statement. Dixon over to Sable. Sable with it now. Back out of the Dixon. Dixon's going to drive. Got the Petit. No good. Rebound. Bobbled. And it'll be. No signal here. Nobody knows. <laughs> what is all? Whoever gets the ball first here. Gonzaga ball. Number zero. Blake Harper into the game for the Eagles. About a Dixon. 
Jackson with it to Batiste. I'm sorry. Save for three. He got it. Missed a couple of good looks early. He's hit back-to-back -back threes now. Certainly, if we're going to double team, we got to find him. Absolutely. Winston here with the Stags. 30 seconds left. 33-25. Stags here in the first half. About a nine-second differential. Warner with it to the top. Over to the wing to Winston. Looking for a cutting Thomas. Not there. Ten on the shot clock. Pull it back out. Screen by Thomas. Winston to drive. And for J.J. Turnover. Dixon with it. He'll push. And the Thomas Batiste was blocked by J.J. Massacoy. And we'll have a jump ball. Samantha ball with 2.6 seconds left in the first half. Two point six to go. Obviously, we'd love to get a great shot. We could probably get maybe two dribbles out of it. The big thing here is no turnovers. If we can catch it on Arnold, the dead run. Arnold to inbound over to Winston at half. He'll get it over, over to Sober. Quarter three, the buzzer, no good. Well, that'll take us to half. Stags lead 33-25 going into the. Uh,
right here. Looks like we're getting ready to start the second half. We've got a minute left here for the start of the second half. Stags lead 33-25 here. Well, important stuff, first of all. I forgot to say hi to my grandchildren. So, to Kel and Robert, uh, Ainsley Ann and Brody Jones. Hope you're having a good night. Actually, most of you should be asleep right now, but uh, my wife gives me a hard time. I don't do that. But great first half for the Stags. You know, contributions to a lot of people. The stats here from the first half. The uh, Malcolm Thomas here led the Stags with eight points. David Winston here with five. Mason So four. Adam Fox four. J.J. Massacoy four. And also three big charges here for the Stags in the first half. For Gonzaga, uh, Ryan Sable led them with nine points. Nick Lewis, six. And then Derek Dixon with five points here in the first half. So a couple things for the Stags. One is we got to stop penetration by Derek Dixon. He's been getting in the lane, causing all sorts of problems. And then if we're going to trap out of the double team, Gonzaga's doing a great job of making that extra pass. And usually the last one ends up in the hand of Ryan Sable, and he's got the three threes. Correct. That's what you don't want to happen. To start the second half here, with Stags to come out as they did start the game with number two, Jaden Winston, number one, Malcolm Thomas, number five, Isaiah Arnold, number 11, Adam Fox, number four, Mason So. It'll be Gonzaga ball here to start the second half. And they'll be coming right at us, right towards our student section. Derek Dixon to inbound and start the second half here for the Eagles. Into Lewis. Lewis here guarded by Winston. Over to Sable. Sable with it. Want to pick. Pull up at the elbow. And out. Rebounded by the Eagles. Going to be tie up here. Jump ball. The Matha ball. Rebounded by Daniel Holmes here. Got tied up with Malcolm Thomas here for a jump ball. Winston here to inbound for the Stags in the so. Stags with a little bit of luck there on the alternate possession. Little Didn't secure the rebound, but it'll be their ball. Over to Fox here. A little one, two, two pressure by the Eagles. Over to Arnold. Arnold on the wing. Hand off to So. So think about it. Drive. Over to Winston. Winston at the top. Kick out to Arnold for three. Got it for the Stags. Nice little drop off by Jaden Winston. A little bit of penetration, kick out to the shooter. Dixon with it, pull up. It's good for the Eagles, right back at you. Well, it said stop penetration. I didn't mean so he could pull up any jump shot. <laughs> Winston with it here over the timeline for the Stags. Over to Sow on the wing, all by himself. He'll drive. Floater, no good. Rebounded, put back in by So. Stags, a little volleyball on that one. Kept it alive, so he's able to cash it in after the first miss. Dixon with it here. He's going to drive, pull up at the free throw line. Got it. Not right, what you want to do the Stags with Dixon. Back to back. He's got a nice pace to his game. He's able to turn the corner, but he's under control. Able to square his shoulders on the shot. Winston with it here. Hand off to Arnold. Arnold over to So on the wing. So's going to get it deflected. It's going to be... The math of all here. So to inbound for the Stags. Over to inbound to Fox. So will cut. Fox will drive. Spin move. Fade away pull up. Is in and out. Rebounded by So with the put back. No good. Rebound to Lewis. Lewis to push for the Eagles. Run the offense. Stags man to man. Lewis with it over to Sable. Sable with it. And Daniel Holmes. He's blocked, deflected by Thomas. Over to So. So with it. And Arnold. Arnold over to Winston. Winston on the wing. He'll drive. And it'll be a blocking call here on the Eagles. Stags on that semi fast break in transition. Jaden Winston with the lane was able to veer away from the charge. Jaden Winston will shoot two here for the Stags.
First one is good. Three fouls on home, so he'll take a little bit of a rest. Plants it on the second, and it's good. Dixon inbound. Over to Batiste. Batiste to Dixon. Dixon over to Sober. Over to Lewis. Lewis bring across the timeline for the Eagles. Then to Batiste. Batiste back out to Dixon. To Lewis. Lewis to Dixon. It's going to be a foul call on the Stags here. Adam Fox. That's going to be three on Adam Fox here for the Stags. Tough luck for Adam Fox. He played well early, got a little bit of foul trouble, so he didn't get the minutes in the first half. He's their blue collar player, so he's going to be around contact a lot. Sable inbound here in the Lewis. Lewis back for three, a deep three. No good. Rebound to Malcolm Thomas. Nice job by Malcolm Thomas with the box out and then the important part securing the rebound. So at the top here, Steve Thomas. Thomas with a fadeaway jump shot. It's going to be no good. Over to Batiste. Batiste with it. He'll go coast to coast. And it's going to be uh, blocked by Thomas with a foul on So here. <laughs> Thomas Batiste here to shoot two. First one's no good. There's a Massacoy in for the stag. Play Adam Fox. Tease the second one here. And it's no good. Rebounded by Malcolm Thomas. First one long, second one short. Stag's on the move here. So Places. with Screen by Thomas, pull up at the elbow, no good. Rebound, bobbled away to the Eagles. Dixon with it. He'll push, he'll drive over to Saban. Saban with it on the wing, he'll drive. Down the middle, up and under, no good. Rebounded by DeMatha, it's going to be knocked out by Gonzaga. J.J. Massacoy around the ball again, wasn't able to secure it, but Gonzaga knocked it out. Gonzaga again, a little 1-2-2 -two -two press here. Back to get it over with Winston. Over to Arnold. Arnold to Mason. So at the top. He'll drive. Over to Malcolm Thomas. Corner jumper. No good. Rebound to Gonzaga. We're going to have a foul here on the floor to Isaiah Arnold, I believe. Yeah, kind of a waste of a foul there. Wasn't really contesting a rebound. It was actually going away from it. But bodies collided. That's three team fouls on the Stags. Love the fact they're being aggressive, but we want to keep them out of that bonus where you get the free throws. Freshman uh, Ashton Meeks here, number three in for the Stags. Lewis over to Sable. Sable with it to Dixon in the corner. Dixon at the top of the three. No good. Rebounded by the Eagles. Over to Dixon for three again. No good. Rebounded again by the Eagles. And we'll have a foul call on the Eagles. Or no, the Stags, I believe. We'll hold on the Stags. My apologies. Long shots, long rebounds. Stags unable to close out the possessions. Kate Sebastian enters into the game for the Stags. Dixon the inbound. Over to Batiste. Batiste over to Lewis. Guarded by Asher Meeks. Now blocked by Malcolm Thomas. Perfect timing. Great block, block by Malcolm Thomas. Covering up a Defensive mistake by the Stags. Winston here at the top for the Stags. Get the offense here. We'll have a timeout, full timeout here by the Stags. 3.53 left here in the third. Stamathan leads 40 to 30. Malcolm Thomas has become quite a force down the defensive end. I think the offensive end will come, but he's such a force. He's able to time it. He's got the long reach. He's got the great ups and his teammates are going to love him because when they make a mistake, they know that he's got their back. Absolutely. Very athletic. Uh, can block out with the best of them. So a nice crowd here 
uh, in the Brennan Looney Convocation Center tonight. Uh, good student section here by the Stags. Some other games tonight, we got St. John's at O'Connell, McNamara PVI. Thursday, Ireton will go to Gonzaga, so that should be their next game. Never a bad night at WCAC. Mm -hmm. Stags coming out of here, out of the timeout. A fun fact, Roger Garfield, I got to know, been assistant with Steve Turner for a number of years here, but going back in time, he was assistant over at Georgetown Prep when I first met him. The head coach at that time was Herb Cruzen, who's our freshman coach. Yes. How funny. Cade Sebastian here to inbound for the Stags and the Winston. Back to Sebastian, handoff to Winston. Malcolm Thomas down low. Still bang and go up with it. Nice little finish. So often Malcolm has a hard time getting his legs underneath him that time. Used his upper body strength, kind of powered the thing off the glass. A very efficient finish. Sable at the top for the Eagles. Over to Lewis. Lewis will drive. He'll pull up. Floater. Good for the Eagles. Saw so Malcolm Thomas coming over with the help. Decided to go with the pull up. A little teardrop there. A little tweener shot. Winston with it here for the stag. He's looking for a Kate Sebastian. He'll hand back off to him. Try to hit it, Cunning Thomas. Lazy pass by the Stags. Lewis with it, coast to coast. And he'll lay it in. Tough lay in for Nick Lewis. Tough shot on the move, off the glass. Obviously, any turnover is bad, but those live ball turnovers start the offensive possession for the other team. Thomas here with it, over to Sebastian, over to Winston on the wing. Hit Meeks at the top, Meeks will drive, go to J.T. Massacoy, eight on the shot clock. Meeks with it at the, at the top. Five on the shot clock. Winston's gonna have to pull it here with two and one. It's gonna be stolen by the Eagles. Dixon on it, he's running. And we'll have a foul, I believe, on the floor here by Massacoy. Going to bring Derek Dixon here, the sophomore for the Eagles, the line for two. First one is good. Stags getting a little sloppy with the ball. They've been pretty good all night. But as Coach Wooten you say, your offense needs to be your friend. You don't want your offense starting their offense with those live ball turnovers. Second or two here for Dixon. And it's going to be good. Bath leads 42-36, 2.27 left here. Last four to inbound. A little pressure here by the Eagles. And the Jacob Wallace has entered the game for the Stags. Ashton Meeks, the freshman from deep of three. He'll knock it down. Nice job by Jacob Wallace. Beat the pressure. Found the open shooter. Takes it over to Sable in the corner. Be deflected by Sebastian, who could have had a steal. Referee interference there. Good deed by K, but then better defense by the referee. I've been Jay Caden in here for the Eagles to inbound. And the Lewis Hill run the uh, point guard here for the Eagles. Top. Over to Sable for three. No good. Rebound to Wallace. Wallace is going to push for the Stags. Jacob Wallace, the two sport athlete here at Damatha, also on our varsity football team here. Well, we'd love to see a little penetration. Maybe find Ashton Meeks again for an open three. <laughs> Meeks took it over, call for traveling there. We found it, but not the result we're looking for. Minute 38 to go, 45-36. Allen Bursaquat into ends of the game for the Stags. Number 34. So again, different lineup for the Stags here. All right, so we got to make sure we're composed on the offensive end. I think defensively the effort will be there. Lewis trapped here. Great pressure by the Stags. 11, Jack Caden 
and get it for the and one. Nice little finish by Jack Caden. Caught the ball in traffic. They return his left shoulder, kiss it off the glass. Jack Caden at the line here for one. And it's no good. We're down to Gallon. Gallon over two. Jacob Wallace will run the point for the Stags. And the Massacoy. Massacoy with it. Hook shot. No good. Put oh. back in by Gallon for squad, I think. Great effort. Got his left hand. Kept the ball alive. Go to the front of the rim. Sometimes you get lucky. Dixon here on the drive. Good D. Massacoy trying for a fourth, and he's going to get it. Fourth charge of the night for J.J. Massacoy. Coming up huge there for the Stags. Mason So re-enters the game here for the Stags. J.J. Massacoy, his fourth charge. I don't know if we keep that record, but it might be one. So the senior, the UNCG commit here. 49 seconds left here in the third quarter. Stags lead 47-38. Over to Ashton Meeks. Meeks back to So. So on the drive. Pull up. No good. Rebound. Great put rebound by Jacob Wallace. Back out to Ashton Meeks for three. No good. Rebound again by Wallace. Got Kate Sebastian in the corner for three. Got it. Big sequence by the Stags, keeping the ball alive, getting the extra shots. Lewis on the drive of a foul on the floor here for the Stags. Eighteen point seven seconds to go. Stags up 50-38. Nick Lewis to the line here for the Eagles. Going to shoot two. First one rattles in there. And the second is good. Jack Caden back in for the Eagles. Sebastian here to inbound for the Stags. A little pressure here by the Eagles. 18, 18 seconds left here in the third. We'd love to score, but the most important thing is we get the last shot. No turnovers. So to Meeks, back to So in the in the gallon with a give and go to him. So and he'll oh oh looks like he had a black call and then changed his mind. Charge here on the Stags. Kate in here to inbound for the Eagles. Six point four seconds left. In the third, Winston will come back in replacing So. Three fouls on So. Look at Stags, want to be a little bit soft here. We don't want to. Oh, let home run hitter. Right to Lewis. He's going to. Oh, he missed it. He missed the layup. Winston with it now. Over to Meeks for three at the buzzer. No oh. good. Well, it's the end of the third quarter there. Stags lead 50 to 40. A little excitement there to end the uh, quarter there with the missed layup. Well, they gave up the here. home run ball, all right, but they forgot to touch home plate.
Jack Caden here to inbound for the Eagles. In, in the Lewis. Lewis with the ball. Top to Batiste. Batiste with it. Back to Lewis. Oh, we're going to have a backcourt call on Lewis. Stags, decent pressure, forcing them out. Backed up. Just didn't know where he was. Stepped over the line. Stags ball. Takes an inbound into so. Mason So doing a little more of the ball handling up front. So with it, nice drive. Not going to go. Stable to Caden. Caden with it. And he'll lay it in. Jack Caden there, lay in for the Eagles. Arnold in the So. Mason So with the drive last time. When he does that, one of the other guards has got to get back. Somebody's always got to get the hole. So with it here over to Arnold on the wing. Back to So. So with the cutting Thomas. Thomas will shoot it and get fouled here going up. Foul's going to be on Thomas Batiste. That's his second. second. Thomas to the line for two here. Nice little set there by the Sags to get Malk on the ball where he can do some damage. Bring him out high. Run him off the screen down the lane. First is no good up front of the rim there. Certainly, if you're looking at this game, the Stag's in good position right now, up eight, seven minutes to go. But foul shooting is going to play a big part of their ability to hold on to this. And this the second lead. will be short. All right, Lewis over to Dixon. Dixon on the drive. Reflected a little bit by Thomas. With Arnold with the rebound. Nice job by Isaiah. In with the big guy. He was able to secure the rebound. Mason so for three. Pull up. No good. Rebound by Arnold. Arnold in the corner. Back out to Winston. Good decision. Great effort getting the rebound, but nothing going on there. Let's kick it out. Let's run our offense. Ten on the shot clock. Winston with it over to Fox. Looking for Arnold. Five seconds on the shot clock. Fox will get it taken away by Lewis. Then he'll foul him. Again, shot clock running down there last play and couldn't get a good run there by Fox. Going to bring Nick Lewis to the line for a one and one here. Certainly not happy. Uh, it's Fox's fourth foul, but I don't think Nick Lewis is going to miss that layup. Oh, first one for Lewis is out. It's going to be deflected out of bounds. Stags ball. Fifteen forty-two, six thirty to go. Ball in the so. So with it, he'll drive. And it'll be stolen by Sable, and Mason will foul Sable for the hold. Stags, eagle to go to line, shooting two now. Stags getting a little bit, a little bit of trouble on offense, not getting that good ball movement. They've had some good action there where they've moved the ball, reverse of one side to the other. They got Mal Malcolm Thomas on some shuffle cuts in there, slide him down to the box. Love to see him get back to that. <clears throat> Second one here. Is good. Stags lead 50-44, 6-18 left in the ball game. Winston here, struggling for somebody to get it into. Finds Arnold. Back to Winston. Winston will get across the timeline here for the Stags. Guarded by Lewis. A good point guard matchup right there. Over to Massacoy. Over to Arnold on the wing. Darius Vance in for the Stags. Winston on the drive. Going to call the call for traveling. Not the turnover you want right there if you're the Stags. Couple empty possessions in a row for the Stags here. They're gonna have to make it happen on the defensive end. All right, love to see a good defensive stop. 
maybe create one of those live ball, ball turnovers, have it work for them. Get a little run out, get out of this little uh, all over to Batiste. Batiste, get it, pump. Over to Sable Hill, knock it out of bounds off his foot. The math of basketball. Tough luck for the Eagles. Ryan Sable had turned the corner. <laughs> Nothing but laying ahead of him. Just wasn't able to handle it. The math of the ball on the baseline. Pressure here by the Eagles. Little one, two, two. Tag somewhat cautious. Coach Jones with a good timeout. Uh, Jaden had taken across. They were about to close the trap there over there in the corner where they had everything working against them. Zags need to talk it over, see if we get things going on the offensive end. Still in good shape, 50 to 44. We go in the fourth quarter, but we got to end that bad streak of bad possessions here. See if we can get one of our better players a shot where they're comfortable. Uh, inbound the ball. <clears throat> So looking at the lineup out here, I want to get Malcolm Thomas a shot where he's comfortable. Winston with it here. Gonzaga a little two-three zone now. A little change up. Look for Isaiah Arnold to get something. Down to seven here on the shot clock. Down to five. Winston, top of the three. Got it for the Stags. Big shot. <clears throat> Label for the Eagles. He'll drive. Deflected by Winston. Corralled in back by the Eagles. Blocked by Thomas. Pass can't figure out Winston now with the ball over to Arnold. Arnold on the wing. He'll drive. Pull up in the middle. The foul on the floor, looks like. Foul on Dixon here for the Eagles. Ashton Meeks, the freshman, will return for the Stags, number three. Uh, the inbound here on the baseline for the Stags. Coach Jones hoping Gonzaga was staying in that zone, got his shooter in there. Massacoy with it, he'll do a spin, and they'll have a charge call on J.J. Massacoy. Little out of control there. Caught the ball up at the elbow. It's really hard to reverse field in there. That'll be his third. Cade Sebastian will replace him, the sophomore. Fifty-three, forty-four, four forty-six to go. Stags man to man. Sophomore Lewis for the Eagles over Dixon in the corner. Back out to Lewis. Lewis with it, guarded by Winston. He'll drive. Back out to Dixon. Wide open in the corner for three. No good. Rebound to Winston. And Winston will slow it up here for the Stags. Coach Jones getting the set that he wants. Screen by Thomas. Winston will get it. Floated up. No good. Deflected by Lewis. Lewis with it. He'll push. Hand off to Dixon. Dixon with it. He'll be fouled on the way up by Kate Sebastian. We go line for two. Stag's going through a little bit of learning. Obviously, you love to be ahead, but you got to learn how to play when you're ahead. You don't want to be too passive. You keep on doing the things that got you that lead. But sometimes you get a little stagnant. Still a ton of time to go here. See the line for two. First one is no good. He's got a nice looking shot. He's had some tough luck tonight on the foul shots. But good shooter. He'll have a great career up there at Harvard. Like the Tommy Amaker, a local guy. Second of two. It is good. Jaden Winston here, the senior. Great man to man for Gonzaga. See if we get a little movement here. Winston over to a wide open Isaiah Arnold in the corner. No good. Rebound Sebastian. We're going to have a foul on K to push. It's going to be Eagle ball. Good call. Long shot, long rebound. He didn't need to push. It was coming long. He got in. Just kind of a lazy habit. Put his hands in the back. That'll put the, that'll put the Eagle to the line again for two here. 
That's one of those ones you almost want instead of boxing out, box in. Just hold your position. Let the ball go over his head. First one of two by Lewis. No good. Second of two is off. Rebound to Thomas. Thomas to Arnold. That's going to bring it up for the Stags. Hit Asiko at the elbow. Hand off to Meeks. Meeks with it. He'll drive. Kick out. Stolen away by Lewis. Lewis on the drive. Zero step. We have a blocking call on DeMatha. Going to be on Isaiah Arnold. Tough call, bang, bang, just maybe wasn't quite set. But again, those live ball turnovers, Gonzaga's off to the races. I bring Lewis to the line for two. And certainly Nick Lewis is not a guy you want to try and defend in the open court like that. First one's good. Second of two is in and out. Rebound to Thomas. So to run the offense here for the Stags. UNCG commit. Guarded by Sable. They hit Maskell at the elbow. Kick out to Thomas. Thomas is going to be called for a travel. That time, J.J. Massacoy made a good decision. Malcolm Thomas just wasn't ready for the pass. Kind of caught him between strides. Caught him for the walk. Lewis here, guarded by Winston. Over to Dixon, guarded by Arnold. Daniel Holmes with it. He'll drive. Blocked away by Arnold. Winston will get it. He'll slow the pace down here for the Stags. Little timeout. Stags had the opportunity to push that one. Decided to to walk it up and call timeout. So we got 2.48 to go, 53-47. Stags still in control. So last time we came out of a timeout, Stags were able to run something good, get a good shot. So hopefully we'll get the same result here. Here's where you start to get into the time and score that you work on every day in practice. So right now, both coaches going over how many timeouts they have, where the alter possession. Gonzaga knows they've only got 14 fouls, so they got two to give if they're in a situation where you know, they just want to stop us and let us take the ball out of bounds rather than um, let us get into the lane where we can score. Absolutely. Big possession here for the Stags. Eagles have been on a little bit of a run here. So if I remember correctly, we were at 50 to 40 at the end of three. So we're at 53 right now. So CIS has scored three. The good news is Gonzaga scored seven. So we've got 2.48 to go. So a little over five minutes of play. Not much offensively going on. Stags inbound here. So, so with it, we'll have a foul here on the Eagles. Stags might have got lucky there. <laughs> Obviously, I'm forward to Mather, but that was just a tough call. Arnold in the so. So they run the offense for the Stags. Thomas on the elbow. He'll go up and score in there for the Stags. Tough move. We had talked about it earlier. Under control, using his size off the backboard. An efficient shot. Dixon with it. He got the Batiste for three. He'll hit it in the corner. And we'll have a timeout, Eagles. 
55-50. DeMatha leads here in the fourth. Great job by DeMath out of their timeout. Again, they get one of their players uh, a shot where he's comfortable. Malcolm Thomas able to knock in that little bank shot there. But what an answer by Gonzaga where they needed it, right? Spread goes back to eight. They get Thomas Batiste, the shot in the corner, knocks down a three, so we're back 55-50. Again, thanks to Deshaun, uh, Laurent, and Steven here for helping us out. Absolutely, today. great job. Couldn't have it. You know, we were da down a man with uh, Corey Puffin. It only took three people to replace him. <laughs> okay. But the downside is if the reviews are good, he could be out of a job. So it'll be Stag's ball on the baseline here. Left here in the ball game, Winston the inbound. He'll get so so with it in the Winston. Winston hit ahead to Malcolm Thomas. Thomas on the drive, and he'll Tough score three. inside for the Stags. Only a junior, but that was a senior type of shot. My teeth needs a basket. Obviously, he's very talented, but his will had a lot to do with him making ah. it. JJ Massacoy in for the reach there. His fourth. Now what you want to see there if you're the Stags? Well, it's a learning process, and I don't know about all of J.J.'s minutes, but I don't know if he's been in a lot of close games this year, two minutes to go, plays like that. So good effort. Just think that, you know, every time we foul, we go, they go to the foul line, clock not running. Daniel Holmes for two, first one in and out. And we don't have the stats up here. But I have to figure, win or lose, Gonzaga's going to look at their foul shooting and say, you know, we had we left a lot of points out there. Second of two here for Holmes. It's no good. Rebound. Winston bobbled on the floor here. Scramble. Jump ball. To the math of ball. 154 here. Stags lead by seven here in the ball game. Great effort by both teams, putting it down on the floor. A bit of a, a scrum there. He stags ball, 57-50, a minute 54 to go. Keeping in mind now the arrow goes the other way. A little pressure here by the Eagles. A little one 2, two. They're going to look to trap that first pass, I would imagine. Arnold to inbound. The cell right in the corner, back over to Arnold. Arnold pushes over the timeline. Here go all the way down. Winston for three, no good. Rebound to S S Sable, Sable with it. He'll drive, kick out to Batiste for three in a corner again, it's gonna be good for the Eagles. Great decision by Ryan Sable. You can see he got in the lane, he was thinking about making something of himself, but then he found his teammate, Thomas Batiste, who had hit a three from there just a couple of possessions ago, made the great decision, 57-53. So again, we're talking time and score. If your stag's here, you obviously want to get a good possession here. I'm sure Coach Jones is drawing up the play he wants right now. Okay. Yeah, and uh, evidently our, our camera on the scoreboard went out, so we'll have to keep you posted here. So we got 57-53 uh, here, stags are up. And we'll try and keep you abreast of the time as we go on. Time out here with the Eagles. So hopefully the Stags are in there talking about what they want to do in this possession. Certainly you want to take care of the ball. Minute 35 to go. How aggressive they want to be once they get over. Gonzaga has been coming with pressure, so not only the Mason So, Isaiah Arnold, oh, Jaden Winston, they're switching, they got to work to get open. But if I'm JJ Massacoy or I'm Malcolm Thomas, I got to read the defense and say, hey, if we're in trouble, you know, I got to get open. All right, Jaden Winston's got it, he'll bring it up. And down to Winston here, a minute 30 left in the ball game. 
Guarded by Lewis. Sable bobbles it over to So. So has it. He'll drive. Pull it back out. Plenty of time. 15 on the shot clock. So on the drive. By himself. Laid up. Oh. And in for the Stags. Big bucket by the senior. Stags see the big stop right here. Dixon with it at the top. Guarded by Arnold. The cutting Lewis. He'll dump off. Deflected by Thomas. Great job by the Stags right there on defense. I believe it was Malcolm Thomas on the first tip, got his hands on it. Stags by committee got inside. And it actually kind of benefits the Stags here. We gotta go full court, but possession rather than one on one. So we're at 58.5 seconds here in the fourth left. 59, 53 Stags be the math of ball. So again, Thomas and Mascoy gotta be aware that if these two guards can't get open. I think that's what Coach Jones is telling them right now. If Malcolm Thomas comes up, we can get a layup. Winston trapped into Arnold. Arnold back to Winston. He'll bring it over. Looking for the trap. Here we go. Over to Arnold. Arnold back to Winston. If you're an offensive player, you gotta read your man. If he goes to double team, you know, you're the hot receiver. And to Thomas. Thomas over to So. So on, on the, the shot clock. So by himself. At the elbow, like a tough shot, and it goes in. The old point guard up and under from 15. Dixon pulls up for three. No good for the Eagles. Rebound by Massacoy. Over to Winston. Winston will get it. He'll be fouled by Lewis here with 17.7 seconds left. Stags lead 61-53. Stag student section getting a little excited. But 17.7, Jaden Winston on the line. One and one, so we got a live ball. We got to be ready to play. Winston misses one and one. Push out to Dixon. Dixon pull up for three. No good. Bobbled around. Picked up by Arnold. Arnold with it. Still slow it up for the Stags. Pull it out to So. So with a two, one, and that's going to do it. The Stags are going to pull out a victory here at home against the Gonzaga Eagles, 61-53. Well, all I can say is it's a great league. You know, Gonzaga is as good as anybody in town. We've had our ups and downs. Great effort by the Stags. We played with composure. We're able to defend. They've kind of slowed down a little bit from where they were playing at the beginning of the year, but you got to be happy. Yep, great home win for the Stags, great crowd, great game. Doesn't get much better than this. So we'll be back on the air. Uh, we'll decide whether it's Corey Puffin or Robbie Landini. Right. You know? Bullpen's <laughs> always open. <laughs> 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 All right, so we're going to sign off here tonight. The Stags have a nice victory here over the Gonzaga Eagles, 61-53, and we'll see you Friday night. <laughs>